This was brought to you by Earth on YouTube and Hanson Mobile Advertising on Facebook. Okay, it's July the 19th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, this is Zone 6. Today I am going to be planting pumpkin seeds. And this is what we have. Okay, this is what we have. Uh, we've got uh, these right here, which is pumpkin seeds. Now, I'm not sure if they're pumpkin seeds or if they are actually spaghetti squash. My brother, he uh, got them from China. And they didn't come with the actual name on it anywhere. That's the way they were packaged. I have these stored up from a while back, so I'm going to use these too just in case. I've had them inside this peanut butter jar. And I'm going to show you the growing bed now. Okay, it's July the 17th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. And these are my pumpkin hills. I've got them spaced roughly four feet apart. And there's six of them. Right here, right here, right here, here, here. I'm gonna put uh, four or five seeds in each hill and I'm going to uh, put a fence around it to keep the vines in, not to and help keep the uh, critters out too, but mostly to keep the vines in so they don't get uh, overbearing and start growing out. So I will get that done and I'll keep progress on it and let you guys see what it looks like. some pictures hello everybody this is July the 17th 2019 zone 6 I am showing video of the sweet potatoes that I put out so that I could get some uh, god I keep forgetting the name of it the, the stems that pop out here to where I can get sweet potatoes growing. I actually put this out on July the 15th and I just wanted to get a picture of this. Now I usually don't like doing the whole toothpick with water idea because I've done that before. It hasn't really worked out all that well with avocados and I don't know this is my first time doing potatoes so I'm going to give it a try, see how it works. I didn't like it because when I did the water, I ended up getting little white spots on it like this right here. And then there's some right up in here too. So I'll keep, keep track of it, let you guys see it, get some pictures. And I will keep, keep tabs on it. Okay, July the 17th, 2019, in Southern Illinois, zone six. I have the fencing up, the hills are done, and the pumpkins are in the hills, so it's good to go. Take a picture, and hopefully we get some pumpkins. Keep you updated. Okay, it's July the 23rd, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6, and this is an update on the, the it's either pumpkins or uh, spaghetti squash. Couldn't tell which ones the seeds were, but this is an update on the seed. Show you how they're growing. We've got one here that's coming out, and then another one that looks like it's coming out of the ground there. Got one right there, and one right there. So 
So we got one, two, three, four, and five. I'm gonna walk around and And these might not grow because I found some seeds laying down here and that right there indicates a bird probably got a hold of it so over here I don't know either I'll keep up on it though but we got so far these two uh, hills that haven't grown anything and if it doesn't I'll just within a few days I'll just go ahead and reseed all right it's July the 24th 2019 in southern Illinois zone 6 and I wanted to point something out in this uh, patch right here <clears throat> that right there is something that clipped the top of my uh, I think it's my pumpkins, but I'm not for sure. But I have these still right here. But this is the reason why I always plant more than uh, one. And that's because there's no guarantee that any of these are going to survive. Went back out here and reseeded that one. Reseeded that one. And reseeded that one. So just wanted to update everybody on that. Let everybody see what I was talking about right there. Okay, it's July the 30th, 2019 in Zone 6, Southern Illinois. This is an update on our pumpkin patch. Um, this hill hasn't got anything growing. And the reason for that is it's been attacked by squirrels who really like uh, seeds. I've been putting them down to try to get them going, but they seem to be taking them faster than I get them. Uh, this might be what I'm wanting, but I'm not betting on it. Other than that hill, though, we've been getting quite a few of them. We've got these growing in. And we've got these two growing in here. Those are three that I just showed you. And there's two of them over there, maybe three. So I think there are just two of them. And then two of them right here, three of them, and one over there. So that's an update on what is going on in my patch. Right, these are trees. I'm gonna have to go through and trim them again and keep them down, but I'll keep you posted and update. It's August the 10th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. This is an update on my pumpkin patch. Hopefully it's pumpkin, <laughs> but uh, so far so good on these. In my previous videos, I was telling you about how the squirrels were attacking the seeds, so I have a deadline of October and maybe into November if I want to go for it, but uh, that one right there didn't get any growth because all the seeds were eaten up by the squirrels and all the other little critters, so I just gave up on trying to reseed because as much as I reseeded, the faster I reseeded, the faster they ate. I didn't want to cause any damage, any more damage. So I decided to go ahead and stop on it. Come back through and trim these down. They're growing up again. But at least I've got the, the plants down. And that's a good thing. So I'm going to take a picture get it before I do any changes to this that way everybody can see what it looks like because it does look nice in my opinion but I will keep you updated
This was brought to you by Earth on YouTube and Hanson Mobile Advertising on Facebook. We thank you for your participation. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback. Uh-huh.